Wani and welcome to Wani's house. Today we are participating in the coffee bar collaboration that has been hosted by my YouTube sister Kimberly Davis of A Blessed Home with Kimberly Davis. So she does this collaboration seasonally so we are going to get our fall coffee bar together here and I want to thank Kimberly once again for hosting this amazing um, seasonal collaboration and I look forward to the next one so let's go ahead and get started with this one so this is my coffee bar for the summer and um, I'm on the fence about if I want to use the same layout if I want to take some things out leave some things in but I do know that I am going to use these coffee mugs here because we reach for these a lot as well as these these little mugs here I'm going to put away those were some thrifted mugs that I shared with you last year um, that I that I last summer in the summer so this is probably going to change as but I am going to you keep these um, canisters here now remember these are actually candle holders that I picked up from home goods and just so happened the top here is a gold top these are the tops for the Bath and Body Works candles. They fit perfectly. So I use these as canisters to hold like here are my straws. And this one here, we usually have some type of wafer, breakfast biscuit or something in here. So I'm going to keep these um, and use them in the same way. So these items here will probably be leaving as well as um, this two-tiered marble stand all right so let's see what i come up with i'm very very excited so let's see if it all comes together how i want so let's go ahead and start decorating so first thing i'm going to do is take off all the the cups and everything that i use for the summer in this area i'm going to put it over to the side because like i stated some things i will use some things i want so i'm bringing some old things with the new and um i like to use this side of my counter area for like my coffee bar and the other side where my keurig is because it's closer to the sink so um it's easy to fill up the um, carafe with the water so i'm cleaning this counter off with my mrs myers this is the mom scent and it smells amazing so i am going to use this three-tiered stand again it's just very easy it's very functional to use with the three levels and i can um, put a, a variety of items on this i picked this up thrifting about eight nine years ago one of the best thrift items i have picked up so I'm using this wooden long charcuterie board. This is going to be our base for this. So not only is this going to keep our items off of the counter, it's also going to bring in some natural elements, okay? So I'm going to place the um, gold and white coffee cups. I love these cups. They are so pretty, and I think they go with any decor style. And so now I am using, I'm putting up my double wall coffee mugs. These are great. These are picked up at Home Goods. You got four in the package. So these are some that I already had a couple of um, months now. And these, these are my cafe cups. They are so cute. So you see, it's the glass and then it has the handle that you attach to it so cute i've had these about eight or nine years also they are very functional these were picked up thrifting also you find so many great little deals um when you're thrifting sometimes they're one of a kind and you know you don't have to worry about everybody having them so i'm going to place them into our three tier stand so next i have these small um, apothecary jars i picked these up earlier this summer and so i am going to use these for our sweetener so i use stevia i am i'm steering away from sugar so i'm using um stevia so i'm going to place my stevia into one of the apothecary jars 
And so, and then I have these little gold spoons. I picked these up from Amazon about two years ago and they have the little um, crystal at the end of it. And then my next apothecary jar, I am using sugar, pure cane sugar. Mr. B still uses sugar in his um, coffee. So I'm gonna fill that up for him. And so we'll have that. And this will also have the little gold um, cafe spoon. And then lastly, I have um, marshmallow. So with our coffee, our hot beverage bar, we'll have our coffee, we'll have tea, and Mr. B likes hot chocolate. And I also like to put marshmallows on my, um, with my coffee sometimes and sprinkle a little bit of nutmeg and cinnamon, and it is delicious. So I'm going to place this on our um, board here. And then next, I am going to add the two tall um, candle holders, the one that I shared with you, the actual candle holders. I um, got the tops from Old Candle from Bath and Body Works. So one is for my stir straws and the other is for our breakfast biscuits. And um, they look perfect there and it brings some more of the gold tones to this um, coffee bar. Here is um, a bowl and it's a, it's a pumpkin bowl with the gold um, top. I am placing some of the teas in there, some ginger teas and some cafe au lait, different packet of um, coffee teas are in there. And so I love this because now you can really see like how the glass and the gold and then how the wood is really grounding everything. These two pumpkin salt and pepper shakers actually have um, vanilla um, creamer in them, the powdered creamer and the other one has some nutmeg. I'm sorry, one has nutmeg and the other one has cinnamon in them. For my creamers, I am using um, a liquid creamer. So I'm giving you an overview of this. But wait, we're going to change these gold and white cups out because although this looks um, beautiful, I want it more um, in, I want, to, um, in, I want to invite more of the seasons into this space. So these are the large oversized mugs that I picked up from Pop Shelf. One says thankful, the other says grateful. I picked up four of them. They have this beautiful um, gold pumpkin detail on it. It's so pretty and I think it will is going to look beautiful here. And so you can use these for all types of like hot apple cider, your teas, you can use it for soups, make you some homemade croutons. So many ways that you can utilize this. So I'm going to let you sit back and get an overview of everything, and then I'll see you momentarily. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Nothing's ever guaranteed. So guys, what do you think? She likes it. It is like all that glass. I think that's what I'm going to call this. All that glass. I love every element that I added to this coffee bar. I think it's very simplistic. It is very elegant. And um, a lot of the things, you know, I already had. Except for these mugs here. And I had picked these. Um, apothecary jars up earlier this summer because I knew that I wanted it to be in this year's um, coffee bar setup. So 
I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Wani, and welcome to Wani's house. If you like what you've seen, go ahead and subscribe to this channel simply by hitting that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so that you won't miss out on any of my upcoming uploads. Also, come on over and check me out on my Instagram. You can find me over there at Wani's house. Hit the follow button and then you will be in the know as to what is to come over here at Wani's house. Also, check out my Like to Know It. In there, I show items that I have decorated with in my home and I give you a link so that you can go and buy the items. Also, that is really great because a lot of you ask me where I get this and where I get that. So now you can know it. And also, I have an Amazon store. Go there to find some of the items that I have decorated with here in my home. They're linked down in my Amazon store. Also, should you buy something, I will get a small commission, which helps me over here at Wandy's house. I want to thank my girl, Kimberly Davis, once again for hosting this collaboration. Girl, I'll see you in the next one. But guys, I will see you guys in the next video also. So I'm going to go ahead and go. But before I do, you know what I always say the next time you're in town you can always stop by Wani's house and I'll see you in the next video bye bye